Hello YouTube, it's Ian again. Um, I have this whiteboard here because I want to explain a few things. Uh, first of all, I want to explain how I used to manage my money uh, before I became enlightened in the fiscal responsibility realm. So let me just clean this up. And then after that, I'll explain how I manage my money now, which is a lot more, it's a little bit more complicated, but it it's a lot more efficient and foolproof. And I just, I can't f*** it up. So let's see, first things first, I had a lot of credit card debt. All right, debt, bag, okay. And then I had my paycheck. All right. And it would go into my checking account. I did not have a savings account. Important note. So money flows into my checking account every 13th of the month. I don't know why I just picked a random date. Uh, money goes in to pay my credit cards so that's credit cards that i pay off every month and then any debt i have to pay off that's revolving debt okay so that would be like half of my check all right and then the rest would be in here um the rest would go to pay my rent and then utilities anything that I need to pay with uh, a checking account, okay? Um, also, I guess I gotta mention this over here, my paycheck, I would uh, have 5% would come out for my employer-sponsored 401k, all right? So I basically had about half to two-thirds of my money going towards this, which isn't fun, you know? Especially because a lot of that is going to pay off debt that I'd been keeping around for a year or two or three or four. Um, and I was not saving any money except for that 401k. Um, and that was 5% because it, it was that was the match, 5% 401k match. All right, so it worked, but I got tired of it. And when I discovered Dave's, Dave Ramsey, I had to redo this whole thing. So, here's what I do now. Oh, I forgot to mention, all that credit card debt, I only used credit cards. So that's why I had a lot of, I had a lot of revolving debt, but I also had debt that I paid off every month. So most of my expenses went through credit cards. Now, what happens is I have some credit card debt. Negative, negative. It's smaller though, because I've paid a lot of it off. I have my paycheck coming in to my Ally checking account. All right. I get paid once a week. or four times a month, okay? Uh, every week, $250 goes into this checking account. Uh, it's a checking account by Empower, and it's this startup bank. Um, they don't have any branches or anything, it's just a startup. Uh, and the nice thing about this is this is my spending money, $250 a week, uh, $1,000 a month. The great thing about Empower is they do a 1% cash back up to $1,000 per month. So I spend my allowance, if you will, my spending money. Uh, in a month and I get up to $10 back. So it's almost like I, I have credit card rewards there, um, but it's not a credit card. So I can only spend $1,000. It's great. Real quick, whack that subscribe button.
Um, I'll I'll do a review of this our uh, checking account uh, at some point. Um, another thing I do as well is every every week ten dollars comes out of here into the savings account by a power. And that's kind of my backup fund for this checking account. So if I need some extra money one month, I can just pull it out there. Um, the other thing is, let's see. I have my ally savings account which makes uh what is it 0.9 percent apy so a pretty good return um 150 dollars goes in here every month and this is my kind of my short-term savings it's it's basically my emergency fund Okay, so I'm making I'm making some interest there. It's not much, but it, it gets the job done. It's not just sitting there wasting away. Um, oh, I forgot to mention this one also makes pretty good uh, APY as well. I think it's one one point six or one point seven percent. The next thing is I have another savings account, and this is another I think this is 250 a month and this goes to my wealth front cash account uh, so this is kind of my reserve backup emergency fund uh, and this is so it's a little bit harder to access because it's not with the same banking institution like this one this is an ally savings this is ally checking so if I need to move money back to checking real quick I can this it'll take a few days so this is kind of a reserve savings account um, I think I have I have almost a thousand in here and like 1500 in here um, and then I have money going over here to pay off balances uh, that varies um, usually between a thousand and two thousand uh, right now I only have about eight thousand dollars of credit card debt left and I also have student loans over here that's pretty small let's call this uh, Department of education and that's like about hundred and twenty dollars a month um, now I also have some kind of a novel investment things going on over here and this is about let's see I think I have two hundred dollars going in here every month and this is a uh, these are things that uh, it's not a savings account, but it's not a full-on brokerage or anything. I earn about five to six percent in these accounts. It's just a few different accounts. I'll go over those eventually, so we can call these investments. It's not 401k or retirement. Um, that comes out of my paycheck before it gets to my bank. So you can see uh, there's my system. I have safety nets for everything. So this is. Basically, the only money I spend, like on the street, if I'm going to get groceries, right over here, uh, groceries, gas, uh, going out for drinks, uh, anything like that. Um, sometimes I will use my Del my Delta Sky uh, Sky Miles card if I'm flying anywhere, uh, and then I barely. I don't think I've ever touched this, to be honest, or this, which is really nice. Um, oh, I forgot. I have another Wealthfront account that is, it has $50 going in every month. And this is kind of, I'm probably going to increase that soon, but this is kind of my, let's call this Wealthfront. This is my car 
slash cell phone account. So this is for when I'm ready to buy a new car or a new cell phone. This is my savings account for that. Um, sure beats going into debt. I mean, this would probably just be for down pay payment, but there you go. Uh, don't forget, um, grab your mouse and click subscribe, click like. Thank you.